had a whole montage of me sending this thing up. Oh my god! Well, hello anybody that's watching this. Uh, this is just a project or mainly a test to see if I like making these types of videos, which uh, I think I should make more of, I don't know. But uh, this is sort of like my own little talk show, vlog, blog, whatever. Well, anyways, let's get into the two topics that I have picked out for today. So today, I would like to talk about iDubs versus Rice Gum. And the other thing I would like to talk about is the <coughs> Szechuan sauce. Let's dive right into the first topic. So the first topic is about two YouTubers, iDubs TV and Rice Gum. Now, iDubs TV is a particularly edgy. He is not like your average, uh, basically he's not basically your average YouTuber. And he has a series on his channel called The Content Cop, where he dives into different types of YouTube videos or YouTubers. He basically exposes them for either being slimes or just not being a good YouTuber or a good content creator. And last week he posted a video called Jake Paul Content Cop, which was eventually an M.I. Shamalamalamalam twist, which actually was revealed to be about another YouTuber, Rice Gum, who is a very uh, strange YouTuber. He is mainly famous for making diss tracks on other YouTubers, and uh, that's essentially how he got famous. So the whole thing started out when iDubs uploaded that video, that content cop about him, which he made several points that he brags about having money too much, he isn't really a good person. I think that iDubs truly has the upper hand in this argument. Now another thing that happened was in Ricegum's response he made a diss track about him saying that he was a stalker only because iDubs got some really good dirt on Ricegum. So after that happened, iDubs made his response video called, it's called Content W, where basically it was iDubs' response to Ricegum's response and his reaction to the diss track about him. So once again, iDubs defended himself. I think he made a better claim than Ricegum did. But what I have to say is important about this is that kids are watching YouTubers like Ricegum and thinking it's okay to, if you have money, you can basically get away with anything. Because that's the overall message I think Ricegum is trying to, you know. One thing funny about this entire mess was in the content deputy video, iDubs was in uh, Las Vegas, he was doing this little skit to where he said, I need a police officer. And eventually he found a dude dressed as a police officer, tapped him on the shoulder, turned around, it was Post Malone. I have to say that was one of the best surprises in any of these videos. So the other topic we're going to talk about today is the whole McDonald's Szechuan sauce outrage. If you don't know what the Szechuan sauce is, it's a promotional item that they had for the movie Mulan all the way back in 1998. And here's why it's so popular. So in season 3 episode of Rick and Morty, the main character Rick Sanchez pointed out the sauce that McDonald's had for the Mulan movie in 1998. And he said, it's the best sauce ever. And ever since then it's sort of become a meme and people have been begging McDonald's to bring the sauce back for months and October 7th 2017 they brought it back but only for one day but here is where everything went wrong so there were approximately seven McDonald's locations per state that actually carried the sauce some got as high as 20 packets of sauce some got as low as two packets of sauce but here is where the bad thing really happened. Fans of Rick and Morty or fans of McDonald's swarmed their local McDonald's by the hundreds and eventually riots broke out. People went crazy over this. It's just madness. This one man absolutely freaked out after he couldn't get the sauce and here's a clip. Wait, you guys know this one sauce? No. I want Szechuan sauce! Where's my Szechuan sauce? I'm Kendall Rick! What below the dump dump? I'm Kendall Rick! 
Red! 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 I'm Pickle Red! 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 What the heck? <laughs> So, because of this entire outrage, McDonald's has decided that they're going to have a nationwide release giving out tons of sauce to every McDonald's location in the U.S. this winter. Well, this is uh, all I have for today, and uh, I would like to continue making these types of videos in the future, maybe. I don't know. This is mainly just for a project, but... I kind of had a little bit of fun doing this, so I guess I'll see whoever's watching and will continue watching in my next video. Alright, see ya! Oh my god!